Yo, this is Hitano Play, Xeno Gears, and it's time for quite a little boss battle event to occur. So, last episode we saw Ellie return to Yggdrasil. She actually caused some uh, really bad things. Basically, what she did was to cause a uh, sabotage of the engine, causing probably Yggdrasil to do some stuff, maybe grounding itself or something. I don't know. It's really bad. Now, enemy gears are coming to Yggdrasil, and we have to fight. And as you probably noticed last time, I unequipped phase gear. You put him some rather low level gear as well for his uh, for his liking. Because yes, the wealth fay will be unavailable f uh, for quite some time. But don't worry, he'll get him back, and it's not gonna be he's not gonna die or anything. But if something bad's gonna happen to him, and he won't be, be playable for a while. So make sure you unequip fay for now and uh, get Bart and Ellie ready. Now, let's get going. If you hadn't been around, I'll never forgive you. You. Traitor! Here they come! Hey, that's... Yep. So that is... The Blade Gash. This is Dominia's gear. So she is the first of two boss battles. She is, uh... Very, very easy. She's not really hard. Just, um... Just attack normally. She's basically... The main thing about this boss fight is that she, her, her main thing here is that she's going to basically try to cut you down in size so the next boss battle can be harder, but still, she is very easy. Just use your uh, regular attacks on him, on her. He's a woman, so. Just use your cross. She has a high block rate. But, again, doesn't really do that much. These regular attacks, and then when you get level one, you do still one that lowers. It's hard smash. Repto as well. See, Faye doesn't really have a high response now, so he doesn't do that much damage. Now remember that I put the level one death blower on to Bart. I think we just gotten at the Fames. This is what the blower do. I do a triangle now. There's a new one now called Spark Wave. That's what the level one death blower does. It gives you a new death blow, which is even more powerful than the Chain Whip and the Beat Serpent. Check this out. Oh yeah. The blade. Ah, uh, I was a bit unlucky there. But yeah. So Dominia's Blade Gash gear has very high evasion. That's why it's a bit hard to really deal our damage. You can see that she blocks a lot as well. Other than that, though, she's not really hard. She, she's an easy fight. But she does have a high evasion. They got a bit unlucky there. If you are a bit uncertain about this gear damage done, then you can also just. Um, yeah, see, missed again. It's unfortunate, but not much to do about it. And there we go. That's, that's the first battle. But this was just a warm-up, because the real boss battle is coming right now. The strength drive, which is nice. All the items you can farm for... Uh, in, in side events for permanent. Phew! She just has no one to quit! What? Below! Is it what I think it is? And... Here comes the real boss battle. And it is indeed... The return... Of Hai Shao. That's right, Hai Shao is back. Mia, is that him? Yes, he's in the black gear in the center there. Right. I got him. I have been looking for you, my arch rival. Uh, you again? 
See, a different machine. So what happened to your other gear? What are you talking about? Nothing matter. At any rate, I eliminate you. There will never be any light for me. So yeah, now you can see that now it not it's not um, Dominia who is uh, controlling the high show, but it is indeed Ramses. And you can see this is really dangerous. So he has an electric attack which does a lot of damage. You know, do about a thousand damage per turn if it hits all hits all three attacks at one. And Myung is also here, and she's going to be bad because she can she cannot attack Myung, but she can heal and recover status. So this battle can actually be rather hard. So still do the same thing in the level 1 death blows is still the best thing to do. But I would do I recommend you to put on the boosters. The only thing you want to do, do is to not put boosters on to Bart first, put the wild smile on. Myung can remove the status, but she can also recover health, so it's more important to make her remove the status instead instead. As you can see she removed the status. And uh, yeah, what you can do about it. Attack normally. Attack shower again. This attack sucks. What you can do about it? The response will help though. You can see, we do have we do block ones. So that's good. Hard smash. I guess we can just put out the booster right now, though. Because Myung will have her turn wasted, so that's good. Repo now. Ooh, almost a thousand. We're going about reaching a thousand now with level one death loss. Pretty good. I shall attack next time. It's gonna miss, that's good. And on the Brigandir. Well, this one attack was missed. That's, that's a good thing, but yeah, it does a lot of damage. It's a very. It's, it's a rather one of the harder bosses we have had so far. But it still is doable. The blocking is a bit annoying, not much you can do about it. It doesn't block as hard as the Domina does, though. Let's put on the Wild Spell this time. Because Myung will heal Hai Shao if you don't put up status effect. That's why even even though Myung can recover the status, it's still a nice thing to have because she won't be healing the uh, Ramses, so that's good. If you reach less than 2000 HP, I would recommend to use frame HP recovery. Another hard smash now. I shall. He has the wild smile on now, so he doesn't really use the recovery now, so there should be a lot of misses. That's two misses. You get three. Perfect! No damage. See, the wild smile is so important. And now this is great, because now Bart's turn, the Myung recovers his status, and it's actually Bart's time to put up another wild smile. This is perfect. Because Myung has wasted her turn to, re to restore status, we put it on again. The Ripper now. And then just continue. And that's it. Che! <laughs> Is that all you have to give? Well, too bad. No matter what, I can't let you live! And now, poor Faye. Ah! Armor breach, water floating cockpit, pause vital signs are declining. And now for a coup de gray. Coup de gras. Faye! Now Ellie re releases her air rods. Seen this one before, right? 
Now she has unlocked the use of arrow rods. Now we can use it ourselves. This is extremely powerful magic. What? Arrow rods? Who the? My main tank! I almost had him! Damn it! We have to retreat back! Faye! And this is why Faye will be unavailable for a while, because Faye is almost dying. She's al he's almost drowning in his own cockpit in Welltop. Thanks to Ramses. I don't know, but for now he's on life support. You mean, he'll be alright? I guarantee nothing. I don't know why he's like this in the first place. My fault? I... Then there is hope. At the infirmary at the Ethos headquarters. Faye, can you save Faye? I cannot guarantee it. If we were to take him to the Ethos headquarters hospital, then could we save him? I think then that it will be most probably pulled through all right. But unfortunately, ordinary citizens are only allowed into the main hall at the Ethos headquarters. Whether to become a monk or be deduced by someone in the ethos. Ah. Ah. Uh, I just remembered. I heard that the ethones, atoners of sin, are coming to the Thames from the ethos headquarters. What purpose do ethones from the ethos have here? They're coming here to do some type of investigation. Etone? What are they? They are religious people from the ethos. Who cleanse away the reapers or wells that appear in here in Aqui. So why don't we ask them? I'll ask them if they can help us, but I don't know if they will. I guess there is no harm in asking though. Alright, let's go look for them. I will go with Faye and the life support machine to the Yggdrasil. Bart and Ellie, you two look for Etone. Right. So, yeah, the boss battle could be hard, but because of the timing with uh, using Wild Smile is what's going to help. Because if not, then you can see the High Shot will do so much damage, it's going to be very, very rough. Not only that, but we even didn't get to the counter stance. Basically, he reduces the arm to go in the counter stance, which causes him to counter attack every attack you do, doing even more damage. So that one could be very, very interesting to say at least. Now, to find this Atone from the Ethos Headquarters, you have to go to the deck, then head over to the armor ground, you have a little scene, and then you're gonna meet our brand new party member. Atone? I saw him earlier, but he left. Really? Where did they go? I don't know. What are you doing, Margie? Hi, Bart. The search of the town. I was looking for that atone. This person seen that atone before. Really? Hey, quit resisting. Bart, look! You wouldn't resist, I would sell you for more. What are you doing? What the? Who are you? Instead of the brat, don't you... Why don't I sell you out? What? You want some? Come get some, you losers! You think you're all that? What? What the? You! What are you doing? 
Wait, disguise. Oh no, Josiah. Damn, I remember this. What do you think you're doing? Don't move. Well, wait. Shut up, you dog of Solaris. Wait. A carbon rifle. That gun technique. You must be Josiah. No, Josiah, you're misunderstanding. You always rush into things. She was only helping the girl. What? But kissing talker. Is that you, Hugo? Yeah, yeah, I know, Primera. My some misunderstanding. Sorry, young lady. Please stand up. Looks like you were just trying to help. That's what she says. Sorry about the misunderstanding. This is my Primera, my daughter. I am. Uh, call me Jesse. It's not that little brats call me Josiah. Hmm? She says thank you. Something happened to her and she hasn't spoken since then. Is this the girl that brought about your shotgun wedding? That's a damn rude thing to ask. Look at how old she is. Primera is my second child. The other kid is already 16. Please excuse me. How is your wife? She's dead. I wasn't even there for her when she died. I see. What are you doing here? I have to go shopping sometime. Besides, my son has some unsavory business in this area. Ah! The Tony you were looking for has just arrived. What? Where? And here is our new party member! Is this the reason why? So somehow we need your help. I see. Quit beating around the bush and just help. Father? And Prim, too? This is my son, Billy. Where have you been until now? Things are pretty serious at the headquarters. What do you mean, serious? What's wrong with doing autumn shopping with my daughter? I don't know the details, but you have been labeled as an undesirable element. What do you do this time? Fight? Gamble? Go after someone's wife again? Heh. <laughs> That's just a rumor about me. A rumor. Don't you believe that? Ever since you went into the ethos, you become such a stiff. This lady prevented Primera from getting kidnapped. Why don't you just help out? Well, can we get an introduction to the ethos then? Oh, yes. Please excuse my rudeness. I didn't know you saved my sister. Let me contact medical department at my headquarters. I have other matters that I must attend to. Please consider I'm not only a priest, but also the tone. So I cannot make any promises. Can you introduce us? Yes. Let's stop at Aether's headquarters after this. Hmm. A priest and a tone at the same time. Isn't that unusual? The ethos is obviously very different from a Nissan sect. You're a Nissan sect? Are you from Nissan? Yep, I'm Margaret. Nice to meet you, Father. The pleasure is mine. I never had a proper chance to speak to others about their religions. Can we talk later? Sure, that's fine. But I can't take that much time. I'm a little busy now. Thank you. Hmm, Margaret. Where have you heard that name before? Forget about it. Relax. I came here to talk to Ethel. Let's get moving. What an impolite fellow. You should learn how to speak a little more politely. Why you? Well, everyone, I'll go tell Ethos headquarters that you're coming. When you're taking care of business here, please come by the Ethos. I know, I know. Let's go. Hey, Billy. I have some business to take care of. If you're going back to the headquarters, can you take Primera back to the brat house for me? <sighs> Alright. Let's go, Prim. Alright. I gotta get going. Later, Hugo. I'll be seeing you around. Um, who knows? 
Well, whatever. See you later. later. He never changes. Singer said you should be done with Idris so soon. What? Really? Alright, this time we can really leave port. Are you returning to have you? Are you kidding? You gotta take care of Faye first. That smart Alec kid said to introduce us to the Ethos. So I guess we just have to go to the Ethos headquarters then. Thank you. Why do I always have to get thanked by you? <laughs> That's right, Ellie. Yes, you're right. So, that was Billy, and Billy is indeed one of the playable characters. We won't be get to play him right away, but don't worry, we'll play him soon, because there will be some events where he will be in the plotline, and then there's going to be some rather disturbing events, some really, some, like, really nasty things going to happen. Then we're going to get some cool plot twists, and then we're going to have a culmination of some traitors, some betrayals, and then after that, we'll have a major conclusion to the events of Aqui. And then maybe Faye will be coming back. But that'll be a while too. That'll happen then. Anyway, things are going to become much more interesting, so stay tuned. Like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on social media. That's going to announce you next time. It's my journey in Xenogears continues.